Well, here we are at the jungle farm doing a really important job. So if you watched one of my live feeds, you would have seen that we grow some of our seeds that are really small in these what are called liner trays. So they've got these long lines of um, space for the dirt. And we just sprinkle the seeds into here. And then ultimately we need to take and transplant them out. So this is a gazania. You can Google the word gazania if you can read my writing. And you would be able to see what a beautiful flower the gazania is. It's like from the daisy family, so it's going to open during the day and close at night. So we're going to take, start taking them out of the liner tray. And we're going to transplant them into what these are called um, cell trays. So this one happens to be called a 105, which is convenient because that means there's 105 cells in it. So I'm going to take each plant, I'm going to divide it out carefully so I can keep all the roots. I'm going to make a hole in my cell. So I'm going to make a little hole. Then I'm going to put the plant with all of its roots down into that hole. And I'm going to put the dirt around it. And I have transplanted one of these little guys. So when you um, start seeds, this is not an uncommon process to move them from a smaller tray up to a bigger tray and a bigger tray and a bigger tray. So if you're starting seeds at home in your in your house, um, once they get to the bee, to the size where they're starting to get lots and lots of nice roots, you don't want to get them root bound, so you want to transplant them up into a bigger pot. So this doesn't look a lot, a lot bigger, but it is bigger than where they were. So we'll go through and we'll do that with all of these gazanias. And then the other seed we've done it with is pansies, and they're even a finer seed, and we've, tr we've planted those into the liner trays as well. So we'll need to transplant up our pansies. And we have two types of pansies. We have a wave pansy. I don't know if you know that, but pansies now can be wave or the traditional um, pansy, but the wave pansies actually would, are great for pots because they flow over the edge of the pot. So all of these will need to be done this week. So there's always lots of things to do in our greenhouse. Um, and our greenhouse is getting so full, we're actually gonna have to open up another greenhouse as well. So as, as things get bigger, we need to move them into bigger pots. They take up more space. So then we'll have to open up our other greenhouse as well. So we're glad you joined us. If you have any questions, we would love to answer them. So just pop them below.